I have no idea why you're doing it. It makes no sense. And so I need you to bring me another VOD where you're talk you're thinking out loud because the the thought process is so foreign to me that I can't figure it out unfortunately. So like, this is probably not going to help you improve right now. You have to bring me another VOD because I can't figure it out. I don't know what behooves you to jump on the stage wall and push mid. So I need you to, I need you to think out loud and we'll do another review. Uh, my bad. Like I actually don't know what's wrong. The roadie got the VOD. Congrats on winning the raffle. Neon split flat one. Bet. Dr. Rody, you're down fucking horrendous, dude. Oh, okay. You switched mains. Oh, goodness. And to Neon. Holy swoop. This guy's been playing since episode one, act one. That is crazy. Uh, been playing longer than me. Yo, is everyone stacking mid? What about the... Uh, I can fast roll Don't no, worry no, no, no. about it. Go, go, go. Here. Oh. It's not I fucked up nice. Where are we going? Oh. Why are you doing this? So they were coming B. They're B main. Yeah, I raced through an early nade. But we have a wall for mid, so they literally cannot push mid right now. So why aren't we just looking to fight B main? It's not I fucked up nice spot. Because like right here, you could just die for free. So let's pretend they have a mid lurker. Well, the mid lurker could be right here. Blue. Holding on top of the wall. Uh, I know that because I've done this. And you should know that because you have 900 hours. And so you just died to that guy for no reason. Like they have to break this wall. Couldn't they sage wall up for mid split? Well, so first of all, sage is B main. So no. But second of all, let's pretend we don't see sage B main. There exists zero universe where I ever worry about that on pistol round. Because that would be crazy. Could it happen? Yes. I, in fact, I've called it before. But I'm not worrying about that. That's overly insecure. Like, way more insecure than I need a Neon player to be. A free four guys be. Like, this is so slow, dude. What are you doing? Are you the f mid anchor? You're dropping in front of the wall? They're gonna I'm rotating. Okay, so let's pretend now, because they're rotating. Let's just pretend it's all five of them, and they ran a flash out mid, and they all swing. I could have sworn I have a split guide with Hujin. And I talk exactly about pushing mid on this defense. This is sewer. Yeah. Hard for the other team to flank out on Pearl when you do that. On split, it's the same idea. It's exacerbated like tenfold. On split, you're almost never going to see someone try to flank down mid because it's impossible. Like when you come here, look at all of this danger. 180 degree danger. That's so hard. So the worst thing you can do is give up control of this like deep mid area. And teams will try to contest it. They may fade, suck, nade you. They might flash. So keep like the middle phase of the round where you're going to. So I talk about how pushing mid is like not recommended for the defenders because of this like 180 degree crossfire. And because the attackers are supposed to have mid control, it's um, it's just a bad idea to walk down and flank out mid. But now here you are walking down alone and flanking out mid. Like this is just absurd. Middle. Yeah, and now you just die. Mid one. That. I'm stunning. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Pushing B, pushing B. Reload, reload. Go, go, go. That trip was terrible. Low, 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 fucking low. Bro, what? commit to a goddamn decision. Just go heaven or flank. What's this? Heaven? Oh no, flank. Oh, heaven? Oh no. What do you mean? 140. Spike planted. No one watching behind. Running low. Uh, on site and one back. Let's just pretend this stuns somebody, dude. Now what? Because we know there's one on this side. Like, I just don't get it. Last player standing. Ah, uh, uh, NT, NT. Why are you separating from Sage in the 2v1? Bro, this VOD's a fever dream. You do, you make every wrong decision at every moment. I'm out of here. <laughs> so it's 
2v1. There there will be a threat later when the Sage wall breaks that he could push up through ropes that we'll have to deal with for Sage. But we should just be uh, with Sage right now because it's 2v1. Because right here, there exists a world where Sage loses this fight. In fact, that world happens like 50% of the time. And now you're at a disadvantage. You're playing retake against a Cypher. I feel like every time... Actually, here's my prediction. And we're going to... I'm going to mute the VOD and show you if I'm right or wrong, chat. We're going to... I think our player, whenever they see a hole on the minimap, they just go there. I think that's their, their thought process. It's very flawed. And now we're going to mute the VOD so we don't get influenced by comms or anything. We're going to watch. We're going to watch. Boom, boom, boom. So like... Okay, well, they fight mid. I was about to expect him to run back A. Oh my god, you are... What are you doing? We have no knowledge about sewer side whatsoever. Do you like duo queue? Hella games? You assumed all B. Yeah, but why? We're up. It's five versus three. Why would you take on risk right now? <laughs> I know team queue win rates are abhorrent, but no, we mostly play solo queue. I think the I op is your up. best weapon. Because I think for once, you're not going to push mid. My God, what are you doing? <laughs> Never mind. Dr. Rhodey, do you, do you care at all about the outcome of, a Val of the Valorant game? I feel like you don't. I think you're just having fun. Yes, I do. What? Then why don't you say, for example, you'll bring a back up. I'm going to hold B main. I have op. Like just an example. Because, you know, it's five versus three. You have an op the round is over i feel like you're just in a rush to go next round or some shit as if you don't care about the outcome of the game you care about going next round can you flash right now this is crazy Spike like look now they have an off remaining. did you hear that it became losable. Like you gave them an op. Come on. They will cover. Repeat off me. What do you do about breach flash here? Let's just say they throw breach flash. Can you dodge it? Well, lucky up. Nice. Enemy spotted. Left one. There's one there. Oh. I tried to break the camera. Good time. Good time. Nice. Go, go, go. You will not kill my allies. Last, Last player standing. I took I say. Stealing sight. They're not here. Stealing sight. I took I say. Stealing sight. They're not here. Only two B main. Watch out. I'm out of here. Only two B main.
Dr. Ray, I don't know what to tell you other than with 900 hours, you should know that you're about to peek into more than one dude. And so you shouldn't do that because that's bad. And even even if this guy is only to be men stunned, then this guy back here wouldn't be be stunned. And so you'd want to fight the guy who's not stunned, especially if your crosshair is already closer to the guy who's not stunned. But just the fact that you're so willing to peek this when you know that there's yeah. should we? More than one guy. That's what guys say. Like right here, in my head, you can't possibly peak A. Like if this was one round, I would skip it. I'd be like, well, whatever. We brain farted. But you've brain farted seven rounds in a row, which is incredible. All the way down. Down. Way. Go back, go back. What's up with you and reloading? That fruit. <laughs> so at one twenty seven, Jet dashes out B. That fruit. And at one twenty five, you come Jet through. What the? Going in. That's another. All right, eight rounds in a row. This is good. Why are you still a? Spike down. Two heaven. Two heaven. One B. I'm out of here. Two heaven. Two sight. All right, I don't think we brain farted this round. I think everything we did this round was reasonable and we could have talked about how I may have rotated faster, but honestly, this round is fine. Like if every round looks like this, I think we could we could actually talk, Dr. Rody. Can't they come A over Evan? Yeah, exactly. That's why I say this round's fine because you're actually thinking logically this round. Does that make sense? Now you're thinking in a different way than I would think, but here you're thinking, oh, they are mid control. They could come A, so I'm going to hold A. Hey, you know what? Hey, that's a thought process which is better than I feel like we've had the other eight rounds. So I'm down for this. So I call, I'll call i call this round fine. Uh, yeah. I'm sure we're going to go back to just doing something with no justification whatsoever. Speaking of. They're breaking the wall. Spike down mid. Close one. I can't fathom the universe where they clear this, but sure. This round's actually reasonable too. Wait. Cypher's on site. It was reasonable. Up to this point, I'm down. You know, the flank is a bit aggressive and a bit predictable, but I, I fuck with it because it's logical. But now the Shit. logic goes away again. Do you see Cypher's what I'm talking about? What are you doing right now? Out of charges. Gotta go. Like, where did our logical decision making go? It was online for a bit, and now you're like, why? The bomb is mid. What are you doing right now? Why are we jump spotting B main alone? Ah, uh, there is. Hey, hey. Okay, okay. You can find your omen time to back up. Reasonable. I just swift like a whole mag on him. Holding the smoke. Reasonable. Uh, jump spotting a bit less reasonable. Peeking with Reyna, reasonable. Nice, good job, guys. And now you just enter the realm of it makes no sense again. Like, Dr. Rody, you're stunned right now. Okay. And there's a gap. So in my head, I'm going, well, if Breach peeks that, I'm in trouble. And so I'm pressing E. And I'm jumping to the right or to the left. I don't really care because they're both logical. One is better than the other. But at this point, honestly, I wish we could talk about which one is better. But you're holding while stunned. Nice. Good job, guys. You're, 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 you're dead zoning bullets. I'm going in. Come with me. Come with me. One enemy. And now this is reasonable again. This is reasonable. 
be 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 this is really reasonable. Nice. Yeah. Spike on me. Yeah, they faked, whatever. Oh, and here we go again. Okay. A two. Oh, One enemy no, no, no. remaining. Here we go. Yeah. Nice. So you so you are <laughs> capable of playing rounds reasonably. There's nothing wrong with this round. It makes sense. There's always B. You rotate B. You stun. You fight B. Good. What's up with the eight rounds at the start of this VOD? It's like you woke up or something. For the first eight-ish rounds of the game, you weren't playing Valorant. And then you like woke up for no reason. I, I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you what happened. like Because I have no idea. But that's why you're losing games. For sure. The VOD is like a fever dream. I could not tell you the difference. I don't know what clicked in your brain. But you, you switch between inting mode and playing normal Valorant mode. It's almost like you think it's like Call of Duty or something with how aggressively you push it on defense. Uh, I mean, we'll watch a bit of attack, but I'm guessing attack is not that bad. He's aiming at his head. He's on sight. Uh, kill him, kill him, kill him. Kill him. Elbow. <laughs> Kill him is a crazy call out. In elbow, in elbow, fuck. Heads up. This is totally the reasonable. Just chill, just chill, but. Yeah, like I, I could tell you how why I don't like this, but this is reasonable because there's logic. I'm out of here. All right, I think I found it, Doctor Rody. I found your brain fart. I think somebody's about to around the world while the bomb is planted default. Am I wrong? That's easy. Oh. One tower. Nice. Nice, good even one. So now why we do that? Like, this is the type of thing, if you have like 20 hours and you're silver, I will explain to you why it's bad. But when you have 900 hours, it just doesn't make sense to me. In my head, you didn't think about it at all. You didn't think, is there a reason I shouldn't around the world right now? Like, that just didn't even occur to you. We had so many a life, so I thought it would still be worth it. So first of all, it's, it's 5v5. I'm out of here. That was easy. I guess Reyna kills one. 5v4. So you put your teammates in 4v4, which is dead even. Like, we remove you. Oh, and now let's just talk right here because you could turn around right now now it's 4v2 because you're not there so like at this point surely we turn around check left <laughs> I love six. Like, I wish we could talk about how I don't like your attacking playstyle, but honestly, your defense is so disgusting that we can't talk about your attack at all. That, 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 that we have to fix this shit. It's like you don't want to play defense. It's like you're, I don't know, you have like super ADHD. You've watched a million TikToks or something. Do, 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 do. Stop just pushing shit when you get bored. That is not how we play tactical shooters. Do, 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 do. You are no longer allowed to solo push space on defense at all without calming the push to your team with reasoning. Yes, I'm going to push out mid here because we saw all five be made. No pushing mid while three enemies are unknown with no calm. You can't solo aggress space on defense. You're no longer allowed unless you communicate it to your team with reasoning. I have no idea why you're doing it. It makes no sense. And so I need you to bring me another VOD where you're talk you're thinking out loud because the, the thought process is so foreign to me that I can't figure it out, unfortunately. So like this is probably not going to help you improve right now. You have to bring me another VOD because I can't figure it out. I don't know what behooves you to jump on the stage wall and push mid. So I need you to I need you to think out loud and we'll do another review. 
Uh, my bad. Like, I actually don't know what's wrong. Uh, please come back, though, and think out loud a bit, and we, we can work through this, Dr. Reddy. I'm stunlocked from that VOD. I, I've got no idea what I, what's going on in Dr. Rody's head. This is the first time I genuinely don't know how to help. So I need I need Dr. Rody to think out loud for me and come back. That, that was crazy. This VOD cast a spell on me, bro. Hey, Wuhujin here. Did you know that I stream every weekday doing VOD reviews and playing ranked? If you enjoy the videos, the best way to support me is to show up live. If this video was just uploaded, it's very likely that I'm streaming right now. All of my coaching is free, but that means I need to make money in other ways. Please consider supporting me with a Discord subscription if you can afford to do so. I run many live events for my tier 3 subscribers as a thank you for letting me pursue my passion every day. At 2,000 subscribers, I'll be booking a flight out to EU and to APAC to play in-houses on your servers. Thank you for supporting me.